That's too bad. That's so sad. I'm sorry. What bad luck. I hope things get better soon. It will be okay soon. I hope you feel better soon. What a pity. What a pity for you. Oh, that's terrible. Be patient. It will be better soon. I can't tell you how sorry I am. Oh, I am sorry to hear that. I know how it feels. I take my sympathy to you. You must be very upset about it. I sympathize with your condition. It's very kind of you. Thank you very much. It will be okay, thanks. Thanks for your sympathy. Thanks for your support. Could you tell me how to get to the bus station? Do you know that old man? Do you know how much this car costs? Do you happen to know where to buy an umbrella? Can you tell me what the time is? I'd like to know your name. I'd like to know what you think about this idea. I wonder if you could tell me why the meeting was cancelled. Do you have any idea how to use this machine? Could you find out where she lives? I'm looking for a book about gardening. It looks like you're new here. It looks like you don't know what happened. Perhaps she knows the answer. I'd say it's over 9 a.m. now. If I had to take a guess, I'd say he's 40. Maybe he wants to quit his job. Maybe it's going to rain. Chances are you're doing it wrong. He could be right about it. I guess you are over 30 years old. It's difficult to say, but I think this is the best English course. I'm not really sure, but I think this is the last morning train. Can you explain why you are so late? How come it has taken you so long to reply to my email? I don't understand why you never finish the work on time. Can you tell me why you didn't attend the meeting this morning? Why is it that you didn't tell the truth? Do you expect me to believe you did this by yourself? I hope to see you soon. Let's hope you will get better soon. I believe things will get better. Hopefully it'll be sunny tomorrow. I keep hoping that she will win the show. I wish it would stop raining. If we're lucky, we'll arrive there on time. With any luck, she'll go home early tonight. I would like to buy a new car. I want to be a doctor. What I really want is to have an apartment. What do you think about this problem? What do you think of my new house? Do you have any thoughts on that? How do you feel about that? What is your opinion? Do you have any idea? Do you have any opinion on this matter? What's your view? Please tell me your opinion on this subject. What is your opinion about that? Can you give me your thoughts on the report? What are your feelings about his behavior? I'd like to hear your views on this matter. In my opinion, this is the best website for learning spoken English. I don't think we should get a new car. 
personally, I think you're right. From my point of view, she is the best student in the class. As far as I'm concerned, this t-shirt doesn't suit you. My personal view is that he is a liar. In my point of view, this is the most beautiful island on earth. It seems to me that we get lost. To my mind, it's the right thing to do. I personally believe we're in the right way. This is absolutely right. I couldn't agree more. I completely agree with you. I agree with this opinion. I don't agree with you. I think you're wrong. I don't think so. I'm afraid I can't agree with you. I'm not sure I agree with you on this. Are you afraid of the dark? I'm afraid of being alone at night. I'm scared of snakes. I'm frightened of spiders. I am terrified. I get scared very easily. I was terrified when I heard the noise outside. I'm worried about her health. Don't be afraid. It's not a big deal. It is nothing. There is nothing to be afraid of. Take it easy. Calm down. I promise that I will finish the job on time. I promise you that that's the truth. I swear I will never leave you. I swear I won't let you down. I assure you that I will return the book tomorrow morning. I assure you that I will be there on time. Believe me, I won't make you disappointed. Trust me, I can do it. Thank you. I believe you. All right, keep your promise. I hope you will keep your words. I hope you will keep your word. Just let the time answer it. I have to admit that I was wrong. I admit what I've done is wrong. I shouldn't be like this. Sorry, I know this was my fault. I'm fully responsible for this matter. I have made a mistake. It's my mistake, forgive me. Yes, I take the blame. I was the one to blame. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have done that. I never intended it that way. Don't mention it. Let it go. That's fine. Just take it easy. Don't do it again. Forget it, it doesn't matter. That would be okay. Don't worry about it. It's okay. Which do you prefer, football or volleyball? Which do you like better, tea or coffee? Do you prefer hot coffee or iced coffee? Would you prefer to go for a walk or see a movie? Would you rather have dinner with me? I prefer tea to coffee. I'd prefer to have some water. I like tea better than coffee. I prefer reading books. I prefer jogging to running. I'd prefer living in a city to living in the country. I would rather go home. I'd rather stay at home than go out. I'd rather take a nap than go for a walk. I'd rather play football than golf.
I help you because I like you. I study hard because I want to pass the exam. We have to go home since we have no idea where to go next. You need to hurry up since it's very late now. I can't go out as it's raining. I can't run fast as I'm too fat. I love you, so I will do everything to make you happy. I didn't eat anything, so I'm very hungry now. We had to cancel the picnic because of bad weather. I did it because of you. The flight was canceled due to the storm. I came home late due to the traffic jam. He didn't work hard. As a result, he was fired. I was busy this evening, therefore I couldn't come to your party. Thanks to his hard work, he got a raise. How are you feeling? Are you okay? Is everything all right? What's wrong? What's the matter? Do you want to talk about it? I'm very happy right now. I don't think I can be any happier right now. I feel a little sad. It's been a difficult day. He made her very angry. I've been in a bad mood all day. I'm mad at his behavior. I feel very depressed today. You seem a little blue today. I've got a headache and I feel terrible. Can I speak to John, please? I'd like to speak to John. I'll put you through. Hold the line, please. I'll connect you now. I'm sorry, he's on another call. I'm sorry, he's not available at the moment. Please call back later. Could you ask him to call me? Would you like to leave a message? Who's speaking? Who's calling, please? Could I ask who's calling? Can I have your name, please? Who am I talking to? It's Mary speaking. Is it convenient to talk at the moment? Sorry, you must have the wrong number. Sorry, I think you've dialed the wrong number. Hang on for a moment. I'm about to run out of credit. What number can I reach you at? Who do you want to talk to? Hold the line, please. I've got a very weak signal. Can you hear me okay? Could you please speak up? Sorry, I didn't catch that. Could you say it again, please? It's nice to meet you. What's your name? I'm John. I'm sorry, I didn't catch your name. Where are you from? I'm from the U.S. What brings you here? I'm on holiday. What's your phone number? Could I take your phone number? May I have your address? Are you on Facebook? Who do you live with? I live on my own. I live with my friends. How old are you? I'm 30. When's your birthday? It's June 16th. Excuse me, do you know where the bookstore is? How can I get to the train station from here? Excuse me, could you tell me how to get to the bus station? Can you show me the way to the post office? 
Excuse me, where is the hospital? Can you show me on the map? What's the best way to get to the airport? What's the fastest way to the airport? How far is it to the stadium from here? What street is this? Is this the way to the police station? Is there a supermarket near here? Can you give me directions to the gas station? Go straight on. Turn right at the crossroads. Keep going straight ahead for about 500 meters. The bus station will be on your left. You're going the wrong way. It's about one mile over that way. What do you do? What do you do for a living? I've got a part-time job. Where do you work? I work from home. I work in a factory. What is your occupation? I work as a doctor. I'm looking for a job. I'm a teacher. I'm not working at the moment. I'm unemployed. I do the paperwork. I have my own business. Do you like your job? Can we meet on the 14th? Can we meet next Friday? Are you available on the 14th? Are you free next week? Let's meet this evening. When can I talk to you? Can I meet you tomorrow afternoon? How about tomorrow afternoon? Is next Monday convenient for you? Do you have any time available this week? When would be a good time to meet you? Would today evening be all right? Can you give me an appointment on Sunday? Sure, I'll come. Yes, Sunday is fine. Friday would be perfect. I'll be there at that time. Sorry, I have another appointment at that time. I'm sorry, I can't come. I'm afraid I can't on the 14th. I'm sorry, I won't be able to make it on Sunday. Sorry, I don't think I can make it.